So I'm not really a beer guy. Um, I hear some of you are into it, and that's cool. You know, if that's your thing, I respect that. Uh, Colorado is, is known for its craft beer, but you know, Coloradans have been crafting beer for centuries. Beer can help you get to a lot of important stories in Colorado's history. And so we start off in the gold rush. We start in a gold rush saloon. Ethnic communities would, would gather at the same saloon. You'd have these ethnic enclaves. You'd have the, the Slavic saloon or the German saloon or the Italian saloon. The early brewers who brought beer to Colorado were by and large Germans, German immigrants. Prohibition arose for a variety of factors. Immigration was a factor in prohibition because some of these prohibitionists uh, were maybe looking at uh, the saloons that were places where different ethnic communities or cultural communities were gathering. You know, the Ku Klux Klan membership in Colorado surged during the late teens and, and early 20s. And one of the things they used as a recruiting tool was this uh, idea that they were enforcing law and order and they were really enforcing prohibition. They conveniently targeted the um, immigrant operations uh, that uh, they felt weren't, you know, real American. All the while, we have, you know, records from the Grand Junction clan of them serving beer at their own meetings. So the hypocrisy runs pretty deep, as you might expect from the Ku Klux Klan. Taste the high country. Just looking at the beer industry is a way that you can understand that we are living amid these really big historic shifts. One way you can understand how that shift took place is by looking at the brewing industry over time in Colorado.